What's up guys, Nick here for another Cinema 4D tutorial. Today I'm going to make this one nice and quick. We're going to be covering how you can use the lathe nerbs to create uh, bottles, glasses, anything that's pretty much um, symmetrical or the same all the way around in like a 360 degree angle. So like a spindle of a handrail, uh, a lamp, whatever you do. So if I just quickly throw a new uh, project here. All I'm going to do is I'm going to come, if you have a picture of what you want to make, just come to the front view and come down to options and configure. And under this back tab, there's this image slot. And I just downloaded a quick picture of the fancy vodka here. And all you do is you use your pen tool and I'm just going to do this very quick for the tutorial. You, you'll probably take a lot more time uh, for your for your project yourself, but I'm not too worried about it right now. And you're just going to come up the bottle, and then you want to come to about half the bottle, and then you just come back down. Uh, mimicking what you did and if you are putting a ref like a transparent uh, material on it you'll have to worry about how the inside of it looks as well but if not then don't worry too much and you can do you can just make it go straight down if you really want but I just followed this roughly so now that we got a spline outlining our bottle which is the outside here all you need to do is just drop that into a lathe nerbs and it spins it right around into our bottle. The one thing I will let you guys know is that if your spline is off to the side, it is going to make it wider. So it needs to be um, pretty close to the center or I believe you need to move your actual uh, lathe. I don't know if you can. We'll see here. I don't. There we go. So if I had detached the spline and moved this off to the side, we would just need to kind of center our lathe object with the spline to make it work. But yeah, so I'm just using the the uh, enable axis mode to change where the center of the, the lathe is because that's going to change where it's spinning it around. So if it's all the way to the side here, back on the zero position that it was previously, well, zero's over here, but um, it it's spinning it around that position. So the spline object itself needs to be uh, closer in. So we'll go ahead here, drag that inwards, and yeah, we got our bottle. So you can use that for uh, bottles, you can make um, like a cup, like a glass, um, really anything you can think of. I mean, all up to your imagination at this point. Oops, well, they're under the same thing, but if we go ahead enable access on here I'm just gonna move that over and now we have a nice little uh, cup whatever you wanna but yeah so that's just a quick little trick that you can use to um, for the lathe object and how you can make bottles or glasses very quickly and efficiently and to pretty great detail. Alright guys, hopefully you liked the video. If you did, leave a like down below. And don't forget, if you like the content that we've been putting out, subscribe and there will definitely be a lot more where that came from. Alright guys, I'll talk to you all next time. See ya.